Yo, what's up everyone? Today we got a special video for you guys, so please let me know what you guys think. It's a watch party that I did for Open Division. It's tier 2, tier 3. It's basically the finals of Saints vs. Trick Room. Hope you guys enjoy. Let me know what you guys think. Okay, chat. Let's take so your let's let's see. Here, like we talked about already. I'm gonna root for I'm I'm trick rooting room, for trick room, bro, because it has my boy infected. It this. seems like they're the underdog. I'm going with the underdog. With oh, they're running the Genji, so it's not a mirror matchup. Off here, as you see, not even just the That's, wrecking ball coming out. But Saints also are gonna want to play fast and for picks here. Genji as well. I mean, I like this tree Hanza though, specifically against the Bastion. It's just a lot of damage against a big hitbox. Might have been Tekton, if nothing else, to, to specifically counter what Trick Room were bringing to the table on Antarctica. Well, we'll swing through to start things out, though, and High Ground's been claimed by Trick Room, so it'll be that much easier to play into the Hanzo. Infected, diving forward, trying to find himself a target to swing on. Oh, yeah, this is going to be hard one. for Infected. Infected's right. not going to do anything but be a shield bot. Right, maintain pressure on the point, Trick Room. I would say are still in a decent position, but as the high ground's been given over to the Hanzo, you can see Tree is dealing tons of damage. Oh from no, the oh no. On the receiving end of most of it. Oh, Mikey needs a lot of healing here. CJ is trying to provide it. Now though, Dude, this guy is fucking men. insane at bat. I mean, oh my god. Advantage, but they still can't really push Trick Room back. I mean, really is hard to find without the Hanzo specifically getting Ooh. a kill. Implication makes come out now due to all the healing Look at on this infected. shit. Who just can't land a charge for the life of him? That's Infected's like gonna go ball. They're right gonna now. change Whenever up their team comp. Off of you, there were two or three opportunities. And King there. already oh, has Blade, right. bro. Holy room, shit! Yeah, they're definitely gonna switch their team comp here. Another concern I have as well with. Oh, he's gonna have a free Genji. Blade, dude. Is Magic only is only fifty-five percent on on beast. To find value because of some of these deflects, as you see, King getting some value, but oh. that value actually brings oh. King into range of having his oh. ultimate, so Blade's gonna be there, CJ's pretty close to the Nano as well, and Trick Room, who are making swaps, I mean, they're still pretty vulnerable to that combo. And these are very different dive compositions, but like you said, with one of them having ultimates, that being Wait, they Nano this is so much harder. Wait, they Nano the Zen. On the boat shuts down the dive of Trick Room, they tried to I guess they were the diving the Zen. Saints, but it just never came, they used the Nano for Peel and call it a fight. I, we didn't really see how the fight started, but like you know, just fine. Find themselves a way in. Na production. Every time they go in and try to get into a nice position, Saints sniff them out and remove them from that position, or entirely from the equation. Now you're seeing them with a 50% lead, and they still haven't had to really pull anything. I mean, they nano boost Vega, and Vega went ham with it, but that's all that they've spent so far to get this lead. The silver line here for Trick Room is that they've now started to build up ultimates of their own. If this fight goes along, they might have a chance of getting those online early. The dive completely unsuccessful, though. Now it's oh, Saints' no. turn to strike oh, back. Oh, no, blade man. Oh, miss. no. This Trick looks like a J3 blade. Even drops low. King nearly taken out of the fight. Mikey wants to dive in because shut down. Pummy with the opener onto King. A Dragon Strike in makes room for the Wrecking Ball, but the damage has been done. He's booked away as the mines come in too. He can't even zone this back line properly. Pow oh, what a up, save. What a beat save. A shot for Tree, and he does get one onto Infected. It's Hanbei next in their sight. It's a Sojourn ult pop by Trickroom to try and pull the map back, but Saints are pretty far ahead. It's being turned, though, by the blue side. Pummy and Magic Mateball might have done enough just insulating themselves behind this pylon here and i think that they might have a shot here at actually winning this fight but saints are going to be back so quick and on top of that they're going to have the nano boost that can help them reset mikey's hp if it's not reset already and in fact it is going to be i actually saints cannot believe they flipped that, that point flip to go through they're going to be ready to go very very quickly with another engage the flip is pressure relieved if nothing else trick room can move forward knowing that they have at least oh, some so that's actually really the interesting they're nanoing their zen so their zen the can survive they back up they've pulled the ultimate yeah that's a big one to pull i mean now the next dive is going to be that much more easy to execute well, oh and infected i think is dead uh oh infected and boat shooting different members and for that they're going to pay the price saints are going to flip this point right back on over Ooh. or sub map away of the red side the saints team in red to go ahead and get an early lead and i would say a pretty decisive victory for them as well obviously we did see a forced swap from trick room as trick room certainly have to re-establish their bearings uh this is a massively different team than what they just faced and saints at 59 this is probably what i expected but trick room at 41 is 
certainly all i'm gonna, gonna say this wouldn't have happened. is that if you, know, you have a zen on your team like and the team peels for your zen and keeps them alive like that, that is a fucking hard character to dive dude themselves a little bit of a fandom here and i i do like to see that these players deserve it all right as we leave labs we head on to the icebreaker and this is where the reinhardt starts really coming into play here and underground you see it at its most powerful and saints are going to try and circumvent it they put tree on the far, Mikey stays on the ball. Oh, fair of mercy. I don't think rush. we have ever seen this. Name another team in NA doing this. Nobody. I don't think we ever seen a team pull out Farah. Bringing into this one trick room are somehow going to have to deal with Tree on this far. And obviously they do have Pummy to help deal with that naturally as the. Oh, man. The damage oh, is coming it's, it's in. too much, man. Sick dive by Mikey. Uh, you know, I think it, around the tier two, around the contender scenes, we're extremely familiar with the likes of tree you know we always talk about the the tree gap the tree differential but it, you really can't underestimate the value that you're getting out of mikey who was just in an overwatch league final however Wait. interestingly enough that dive was real strong but Trick Room wait, Mikey was in an Overwatch League ahead. final? I mean, then, wait, do I don't watch Overwatch League. Games. Why is he doing in... Saints, yep, what is he doing down do here? that point presence that allows them to kind of stay even if they drop a player they can sustain Saints looking for that next opportunity here. Did but they drop him? Take note of is he got released? Charge oh. of tree. Very close to a barrage. That could wipe the floor. The Trick Room. It could. Trick Room seemed very aware. Pummy, I don't think I've seen this guy miss a shot. Oh, there he goes. Anyways. I haven't seen him miss many shots in, in quite some time. Tree's being kept on a high alert. He can't just move forward whenever he wants. Dead eyes from the side. No Tree's shot. No shot. No oh, shot, dude. DJ cut off with him. They know there's a far back there somewhere. Just about sniffing him out now. Uh oh. Does mitigate the damage. Holy cow, they turned it into a dive on the pummy. The reverse Uno car has been played, and Tree comes in the second they forget about that barrage. It bites him in the back. Can Trick Room get back quickly enough to contest this? Yeah, I don't know why, but I don't think... I wonder if this is more of a question of can Saints get in position before Trick Room come it's back tough. and just throw a Blizzard on the point and push them off. It looks like Infected is going to die very close no to... No way. Uh, Infected, shutter, dude, but, what oh, the... This man enough. has... Oh, it wasn't worth completing the charge. He needed that to man had an ego charge. Damage. Without the tank, you can't take this fight. So a flip for Saints. And now here's the struggle for Trick Room. They have to find a way to combat all of that pressure that Saints are going to have. But now Saints have ultimates. That's the big thing here is without ultimates, Trick Room can sustain through a lot of the pressure thrown in by Saints. But now that Saints have the ability to, to tip the scales in their favor with those ults and just overpower the sustain from Trick Room, this becomes a little bit of a cause for concern. Oh, man, I think he was going to wait, wait. Trying to take this point away from the ball team is far from No easy. way, no Try way! Oh my god, my god. if he Ooh, got that B and they Ajaxed, the oh my! The way down. Can't dodge that shatter, Mikey. Tree, though, getting a whole lot of issues to this team as they try and collapse onto the likes of the Saints players that are on the ground. The Rockets flying in from above have made it 10 times more difficult. Trick Room has nice shot everything into this fight and come up completely empty-handed. And that's exactly what we're talking about here. Saints also do so efficiently i mean look at what they had to use there they opened the fight with mines they had vega's valkyrie expended there as well but they held on to everything else they still have the nano blade they have nano barrage as another option should they want to go that direction as well trick room they know the position that they're in and i think smartly opt to throw boat over onto the sombra to try to shut down mikey or shut down literally anything Nano blade I mean, we've seen this one a million times here. It's just a story as old as time. Flash and I mean, that's fine. They use Nano Blade. They just Shimi gotta watch out for their Farah Barrage. That's the only ult that they fight. have. Trick, Trick Room has absolutely nothing, just, though, so this is gonna be a problem. Very much, very, sorry, very many. And Saints, they have Barrage. They have Mines coming up pretty soon. If Mikey can get a little bit of a, a slide through Trick Room's five, then... There's going to be a lot of separation caused and a lot of damage. Oh, yeah. Wait, Thrown it's out. even, though. It's even. Nice shield. Well done that was a nice infected. shield by Infected, yeah. Damage right back in her face. It's up that Nana Boost as well from the previous fight. So no tools to save her. Nice hack on the ball that was about to slam. Out. Boat swap over to the Sombers already found obscene amounts of value. He's getting a little Thunderbolt here, but Saints can't find the coordination between King and Mikey to really finish those off. So instead, it's Infected. Oh, uh, Infected's going to clear those mines. More value. 
Well, Bind's out, so nobody else other than Infected can be on the point, and even Infected doesn't want to be there. Nice Suzu there keeps Infected Okay, up chat. Right. Saints are going to come back to this team CJ's fight with absolutely no ults, name. and they're running dive and now. Mikey switched to the, the Winston, over to that but Winston Infected... This is the composition. That Trick Room has three ults. Playing quite a and lot one of them is EMP. I don't think they lose. They EMP, very, Shatter very with Rush. Nah. I think, I think we're going to go to a map three here. But you're comfy, but can you beat three ultimates? I, I am not 100% sure. There's one of them. Oh, it's going to be massive. It's going to be massive. Oh, my God. Connects. It's King down instantly. One stolen away. Saints forced to engage in a suboptimal fight. But they're going into the Kitsune Rush. And now it's Trick Room's time to strike. Infected moves forward. The monkey doesn't have a jump. Vega doesn't have a head. Saints are being taken to a map number three. Oh man, Trick Room turning this one back around. Wait, Timing that was EMP didn't this. look this big though. Here. What happened? I mean, Did they Suzu it? I think it only got Saints one. In control. They were in a great position. They were doing all these. They were going through all these fights so efficiently. They almost caught that. AGS that EMP there. looked I mean, like it was about to hit so everyone. Opportunities there for Did they actually preemptively that like Trick Suzu? Rooms? That's actually that? crazy, bro. <laughs> This is so oh, far a good it series. Even who swapped it. True. I mean, even after the last match, Infected just immediately tweets after the Right here, win. right here, right here. best Sombra ever. And it wasn't probably this time, but it's still both. No, they did get hit. They took a little bit of damage. Oh, yeah, definitely. And that's no, they, that they took a little bit of damage. Their health just went all the way up time. instantly. I remember talking to a lot of, you know, players in the past that NA has always suffered with Sombra play. There's been a couple of metas where we've seen Sombra, but when you talk about contesting, you know, other regions on that pick, it just hasn't been a strength of NA. Maybe it can be now. I'm I'm confused on why the quality is so poor. Uh, it's Blizzard. They're not really a big company. They don't really have that much money. A quick one here for Trick Room. Saints tried to assail on a not super assailable position. Diving into such a small room, the corridor is so thin, it's difficult. Now, when you give over the points to the Reinhardt Cup position, he no longer has a drop, and he gets to play that high ground, this is a very difficult map to take back. Yeah, now Saints have to find a way to surround them in a place where they can get kind of stuck in chokes. Mikey's certainly going to help them push forward. It can soak up a lot of that pressure, but it's not infinite. Certainly no. Health bars remain lowered. King sent back to spawn 20% over the point. But take a look at the ultimates here for Trick Room. Pummy and Boat up the two massive zoning ultimates. And just a blink of an eye, Infected charged into the back line. Actually peels for Pummy quite nicely. And Saints can't what get I'm really forward. happy about so far in this series no is that all, it's not Mikey's a mirror matchup so far. Both teams are really doing, like, they're playing to their strength. One's on the dive, that, but it's one's on, not, like, it's so difficult brawl. To push into them. I love it. To use the high ground this is what I love about over. If it was a... It, everybody from Saints back and around If it was a mirror matchup, I think that would be kind of like Resident Sleeper. comfortable, at least for now, on the point and looking to break out of that as soon as he can. That dead eye was so valuable, though. I mean, it forced all of the members of Saints into different positions. Why? Oh no, oh no, oh okay. that's an F, bro, that that's an F. Like, it seemed pre-rehearsed, like they wanted a nano blade, but... I that's mean, an F, off. bro. I don't know. If you CJ's a better player there, than I am, so I'm gonna give him benefit yeah. of the doubt. <laughs> if you can get in there and maybe, you know, pull something like a sound barrier, but that wasn't even ready, maybe force out a blizzard, disengage with it, try oh, to go have? in, There's no nano find blade? a one-shot. It's just mines? Yeah, I mean... 78% as well. You're probably looking at last fight and Trick Room still have, I mean, virtually everything. The the <laughs> last fight, they only have Someone two ults for Saints. The first time are going to come out. Trick Room have far more to work with here. They want to play proactively. They want to hold the high ground. They utilize it in order to put out the amplification matrix. Ooh. Blizzard is available, though, for both. Something we have to think about. Just dodges the mines with that. Takes down King, though. 3% away from the blade. Infected took down King. I must reiterate. Saints no, no. Oh, I thought he got booped out of the, the transcendence. There's no way that guy's right going to live. Okay, they high-nooned the him. The high ground solidifies their fate. And it's Trick Room taking away map number one. Oh man! Wait. The last two, they still have Big one Blade. last thing to deal with. I can't imagine this is going to flip this thing all the way around. King is great, but not great enough to defeat. Never mind. Five. That was a J three size blade. Pretty much on his own. Trick God room. damn, that shit was small. Was an early lead. Remember, Never mind. This is wow. First of four. Yo, so there's a lot of. It's a best of, of seven. Come, but getting that first map out of the way certainly and helps trick to one the first map. Team. Uh, it's a team that's clearly, I think, feeling like they're playing up. But as we. 
talked to Baitball. This was insane, out, dude. They're feeling very good about their chances in this. I, I think the big question for Trick Room. In the question Trick Room, team, bro. Like trick, trick Room. room. That's, you want that. Grapple up from Pummy. Gives himself a concussion. And back to spawn we go. <laughs> Okay, so this is this is the monkey's coming here. No surprises. It's not really a mirror matchup. The tanks are different. Ball against Winston, chat. Who do you guys think wins? Ball or Winston? Trick room. Looking for that opportunity. You can see infected just kind of down. X Overwatch League player Mikey or infected rank one ball player. Infected did hit rank one on the ladder. He's on the tree. Star child of contenders. Has been assailed. Trick Room make a dive. Saints one of their own, but the swing through from the back of Infected is phenomenal. Tree's got two oh. personal bodyguards, and they are quite tough to kill. One of them goes down, and Tree stay, stay alive <laughs> with the help of his so-called bouncers at this point. No oh way! God, no lives. way! Tree actually everybody lived died, there. So Tree may live. I thought, dude, Trick Room was it gonna win that. It. This is one player you can simply invest in, and the stocks only go up. I can't believe that's exactly how that fight went. I a mean, wonton, appreciate the mess of 37 months, my friend. Looking for Tree, all members of Saints trying to protect him. And Tree comes out ahead for Saints. Or rather, I guess the Saints as a whole come out ahead. I mean, CJ obviously getting off a ton of damage. You can see the difference there. The Delta in ult charge, they're going to have Kitsune rush for this fight. Kitsune rush out aggressively, throws it on the Mikey, but... Trick Room actually behind them. The Kitsune rush is the wrong direction, <laughs> and Tree gets to use a little bit of it, but it's Trick Room who I think are laughing at the end of all of this. Mateball does go down, though, traded for Vega. All things considered, a decent trade. Tree with Overclock, though, is always a threat. And the fight is far from over. Tree slides back in. Mikey down. Does he pop the Overclock? And he hold it close enough to his chest. Tree thinks it's time, and I think it's time. It ends now. Shot onto Infected. One more onto the rest of Trick Room, and it's done. Clearly a lot of investment into Tree, but I think Trick Room did a good job of actually kind of pivoting mid-fight there. Gave a little bit of space to Tree, but Infected allowed that to be okay. Just knocking Tree around, making sure that he couldn't get shots off. Saints, however, still managed to defend. Trick Room, though, got two of those picks, and that could be important for this fight here. Magic 8-Ball needs to get that beat. Oh, nope, never mind. They're gonna... Mikey. I, I'm a little surprised to not see Trick Room disengage after a moment like that, but nevertheless, I'll have to fall back. Yeah, Hanbei gonna die here. Uh, I think Trick Room is probably gonna get the next gonna fight. And, yep. If they don't feed a lot of ult charge to King and CJ, to they're gonna come in with three ults and probably win it. Past, and it would to just go ahead and say, yep, just reset me, that's fine. However, Trick Room, they've got both of the support ults. Saints pretty close to some of their own, but I would say... When you look at the economy, when you look at the fact that there are two ticks capped, I feel like Trick Room have a pretty decent shot. It's basically now or never. Ultimate's available. Saints are gonna do everything in their power to stop them. All five members in the corner trying to keep Tree mm. alive. It's been the name of the game. They spot the soldier and they know mm. exactly where he is. And in the sights of Boat. Like I said, bro, these fights go Trick so insanely fast, man. Falls over, toppling with point A. Gonna cost a lot oh, but they cap! Here, but they Trick cap! How finally achieved the first objective of Blizzard World? A little bit more. It's a game. The dive as well, right? It's a game. I mean, sure, it took it took a lot of, you know, it took a lot of their economy to get here, but they also pulled a lot from Saints, so it winds up working out in their favor. I think it's crazy how different this is. As long as they can defend this looks from top 500. Well, this is basically top 500. The soon. only difference is that these people are playing. On a but team, and they actually use communication here. besides the ladder. You know, it's crazy, right? Pathway, it's fucking communication. You find some picks of your own. These teammates are actually talking with each other. Oh, and it's not random possible. people that they're queuing with. These are people who have been playing with each other for a long time. They know each other. They they played with each other. They have, they scrimmed with each other. The progress of Trick Room in favor for being able to reset that health bar, and they'll do the same thing to Infected, knocking him low, taking him away from the team, making space for Tree to come in and try and beat him down. The overclock valuable, but not as much as they wish it was. The positioning from Trick Room on the high ground was phenomenal, and now it's like you guys don't understand how much different that scrims in. are or on team gameplay is than right. Their comp the ladder. So lethal on the support line, they able to take down Boat and Magic Meatball with the help of Mikey. Yeah, now everything just coming up aces here for Saints. I mean, they're just.
getting Trick Room whittled down to basically no time at all. There's still a lot of distance to cover, and look at this. They're also caught in a choke way, or a choke point as well, that Saints can just continue to pile in on top of them. And that they will. Pummy falls, the rest of the team chasing down the likes of Trick Room. And the ultimates haven't changed. I mean, it's even every single time, but Saints are making it look dominant. Yeah, I think this is probably the first situation Ooh. that we've seen Trick Room in, where... You know, like we talked about last series. Ooh, I don't know. Saints so Saints looking like they're kind of warmed the up now. Well, Saints, I think, thriving a little bit better in that capacity. Dalton is up in a minute on the clock. Trick Room. Would love nothing more than to get that car moving in, but they have to break this high ground first. And they will. Infect it. Forces the entirety of Saints back, but it cost him his health bar. Does it cost him his life? Oh, God, it does. Mines thrown out. Trick Room are still trying. Oh, this is a this is a immediately into the rush. They're gonna, need a, they're gonna need a wipe quick. They're gonna need a wipe quick so they have another last fight. Times. 30 seconds. Immediately shuts down the ultimate and pushes away the push of Trick Room with ease. That's one of the things I like about this matchup as well. Winston pretty solid at clearing mines as well. So one of the major threats that you get out of the mines nullified by just throwing a bubble or just having that cleave damage. And now because of what Trick Room tried to accomplish with that last play, they've equalized the economy and now it's last ditch effort here, 10 seconds. You have to get on the payload. You have to not only touch it, but you have to continuously contest it here as well. Touch is the straightforward part. Contest is the hard one. Trick Room, follow them. Assail oh, them there you go. They, they got the beat. That's actually party. huge. They got the fucking beat. Will mean a second tree. Has one of his own, doesn't use it instead. Tries the amp shot, tries the rail gun. Wait, they off. have to win this. If they, they win this fight, it's going to be massive. Overtime spawns and everything. And they might be able to cap. They they still have problems, beat, though. Now it's about staying on that cart, like you said. It's not easy. And not only that. Damn, that would have been a huge stagger pick as well. also have Saints with Tree going to have so much space, more than likely, to be able to... Trick Room only has beat, though. Soon they rush to help things out, as well as the extra health from Vega. Vega's gonna beat late, so his beat is better than Trick Rooms, yeah. Matrix now comes up. Tree still doesn't use it, but it's CJ. Another pick for the Kiriko. We said put your eyes on this man for some time. But I have to say it again. I've got a yellow man, CJ. Deserves so much credit for what he's done on every single roster he's been on. He does this, man. Definitely an all-star for this team. Absolutely an all-star for this team. And that's why you brought him up in the beginning, because it's, it's so hard to, you know, isolate someone on this roster. In fact, you know, there have been some people coming up to me. Kiriko does way too much, much for this game. And it, you know, they're, not gonna, they're not going to nerf Kiriko because she no. sells a lot of skins. I said it. It's crazy, bro. On, no character should have a teleport, like an immortality, two. a cleanse, it's, it's a boop, 120 like, damage headshot. Give you one nah. Or two. My best guess would maybe be Tree and CJ have been kind of the stars, but the thing about Saints that makes them so dangerous is that as good as CJ and Tree are, and as big of a difference maker as either of them and a wall can climb. be, you could say the same thing about the rest of the team, including... Oh my Paul, god, nah, bro. Right now. <laughs> yeah. And a broken ultimate. Popping the scales, but... For me, one player on this roster is doing a phenomenal job on this map mm -mm. in particular that hasn't gotten highlight quite as much. I mean, Mikey. You, and oh, yeah. yeah I, I hate to mention it so much with the Overwatch League finals and such, but his job was the same there. Keep proper alive. It is a very hard job against Fearless, but clearly he knows exactly wait, how what do to you keep mean and alive. has a nice and ass. Like, wait, job. what? What do you mean the by that? Is impeccable. And Especially Tree that first fight, right? Exactly. And Tree just seems invincible. And we've seen Tree on teams where he doesn't look invincible. We've seen T Tree <laughs> on teams where he, he can be the only person keeping himself alive. And he'll still do this. But when you bolster him with Mikey feeling for him? Dear God, man, I, I pray for whoever's on the other side of that. And on the other side of that is Trick Room, who are lying in wait right now with this ball composition trying to defend against it. They've managed a map win already. Let's see if they can steal one away. No again. way. Mikey is. Oh, no. Pummy's already gone. The counter dive. That's actually a huge pick, dude. Fully to the other side of the point. Infected. Pushed off. Saints. Hit point. Trick Room fall back. A quick first take after an insanely fast first pick onto Pummy. What a what an insanely first fast first first cap, dude. But 
as this map opens up, I think their shot gets a little bit better. Just depends on how Saints want to approach this. Are they going to be able to be effective when they go ahead and jump on one player or when they counter dive? We saw Trick Room forcing a lot of great counter dives before, but it's actually Trick Room who are aggressing forward. And again. Oh, oh my god! Wow, that got shut down so quick. Yo, wait a minute. Tree is running away answer. with this. So the counter dive, not really an option for Trick Room when they're the ones pushing forward and then getting clotheslined in the process. In only 50 seconds. That's all it really took here. A big donkey would. I appreciate the massive when that fight, gift that's up, my friend. Row for them on their attack. And, and just Hummer so appreciates a massive seven months. At their disposal. And on top of that, because they're winning the fights, they have momentum now, especially through economy. And they can keep that rolling for about as long as they like. This is, this is as dire as it gets for Trick Room. We talked about this map being so good for Saints in that they can run that win. Oh, there you go, Pummy. They're even. Both Soul Drones are dead. Trigon. Still 4v4. Pummy, this is Overwatch say, 3 right now. Take right about now. Oak goes down following, though. Now Trick Room don't have any DPS. Yeah, How are they going to fight their way through this fight? How are they going to get those final blows? Hi. Trick Room going to be backing off. Real close to their defensive spawn. That is good news. Unfortunately for them, they need to come up. Oh on man, this that was a little bit fast. of lag. They need to match this, or they're going down. Shots begin to land for CJ. Infected has to stay on card. He sees Mikey in his backline, but he simply can't do anything about it. Instead, the backline is going to come to him. A Katuna rush forward for Trick Room tries to assist in the plot to take down the backline of Saints. It's only so successful though. They've gotten a couple members, but they need to take down Mikey to really secure this one. And they can't. The heals from CJ are too much. Mikey's movement too difficult to get around. But finally, after what has become a slog, Trick Room find their way through. Great job from Trick Room support line, especially as well. Yeah, also, oh, you just gotta ignore people like that, Saints. my dude. Uh, yeah, just uh, evoke them. Appreciate the massive four months, my friend. Find those early kills, utilize those you, 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 that chat, you just ignore people like that. Advantage, but time was bought, and now Trick Room, let's see what they can do with another opportunity. Oh my god, oh, tree. oh my god, Answer tree, nothing. dude. Three. Three. Yeah, I think four? this is game right here. I think this is game. Gonna be a no. Tries to pull back into him with the pulse bomb, but even Saints know this one's as good as dead. All of them standing still. Three minutes, dude. Three minutes. To reassert itself upon their head as they reassert their control of this series. The cough game was really close, being, but this map, this map was though, not close at all, dude. Very intriguing for Ooh. this matchup, especially given the confidence I was coming out from Magic Mayfall in their interview, but certainly it's tree, yeah, like tree, tree, literally, dude, Saints this guy was in one of my things, games with Meg, and this guy went like 44 and three or some shit, something fucking ridiculous with, with a mercy pocket, fights, especially if they can insulate and that game was not fun, for the this isn't, here. uh, this isn't Overwatch League, though, defense, they might if Overwatch League does come to Sigma, Twitch, though, I will definitely be doing co-streams of it, I, I love the pushing a watch, watch parties, I love watch parties, so chat, spread the word, and also the ability to completely, Overwatch League, Watch Going parties J3 2023 setup just trying to dive back onto boat pummy infected protect your backline insulate uh, Britta appreciate the massive 200 bits as well health pool targets that trick room are looking at and considering very juicy right now yeah let's go chip keeping the lives no small task right this first bit of progress I've seen has come pretty standard for this map dodging the dive now and when you're being spy checked constantly getting into this back line for pummy is really really difficult S both Setting teams are running still sombra working that that's angle. still not a mirror matchup for that first on a zen that and brig zen well who actually takes Diva, this first point or uh ball it off of this push i want a vega looks good a great slam but in fact it just gets slept out the CJ difference is what that is. They trade it one for one, which means that Pummy will start catching up in terms of that EMP charge. Not only that too, but very close to the transcendence twice. What Hanbei has because of that damage that CJ set up for Vega. Damn, they, they really the want to fucking kill Vega, sure man. They really want to kill that Discord orb. Back, so he's not God damn. In and Odin, pushing the massive primes up. We saw with Redbirds, it took basically four people to keep their support alive. For Saints right now, it's taking false. It's just the DM keeping him alive, and it's more than enough to keep and him alive. And they capped it, bro, and they capped it on exactly. the first I mean, that's fight. The purpose. 
of this diva is just making sure that Vega can just pop off, CJ, CJ can pop off, and lessen the impact of Infected, Boat, and Pummy. And I think Saints definitely getting some value out of that protection as well. I mean, it's not just about staying alive, but also creating an opportunity for impact for their key players, which is to say literally everyone on the team. <laughs> <laughs> Ak almost lands. Pummy does manage to TP out. Boat doesn't quite have the same ability on his character. He's got a different one though. He's got a post bomb. Oh, that's got somebody's S. name on it. Not anybody's written in anything legible though. Instead, it's a dive onto Vega. Very successful getting a trance out, but the fact that Infected dies makes it. Nah, all the man. More Trick Saints. Room is getting their fucking ass rolled right now. Saints step up. I mean, you see the EMP invested here. Vega Wait, that's actually, actually huge though. Protection over to him. We've seen CJ actually gifting ults to Vega. Just didn't get there this time. It's not over yet. The pulse bomb got eaten, and we still see False in a very aggressive state of mind, taking down Hanbei. Oh Nothing can stop this man. They subbed him in, and he is rearing to go. Speaking of World Cup, this kind of reminds me a little bit of, you know, just back in the day, that old meta of the D.Va giving the nano boost and just having D.Vas just run down everybody in some of those team fights. Now that World Cup's back, we're kind of seeing that here. Obviously, this isn't World Wait. Cup, but it's around the same time, and it's still happening again, man. Wait, when do the World Cup when games begin? Does anyone know? Does start to run them down. Or they, did they already start? Here from Maple, though, Saints are gonna think they're all the more vulnerable and look for an opportunity of their own. Three ten, still a good time bank here. Saints have had time though to build up that EMP that set the tone. Wait, for it starts in, in last... March. March twenty third is when right. the, I mean, the that's World Cup be starts. Here for the Saints, and there's no defensive utility here for Trick Room that they can use to keep everybody more alive. Days? As long as Saints can maintain Vega's health pool, it should be good here. Okay. EMP engage out, and that's all the Saints need. That's everything they needed to win this fight. Infected has been put in a room, discorded, and taken down both, uh -oh. though. Pummy, though. The DPS coming up with a good tier for Trick Room. They're going to need more than that, though, to see this card out. With King and Tree on it, you can't just fight those two. Cap is made despite some small heroics from Trick Room. Yeah, it feels like this ship is sailing now. Have a good Four stream, friend. I'll be lurking for, for a bit. Ah, no problem. Take care. Take Trick care. Room. They're going to have EMP for this next fight, but it's all about follow up. Are you going to be able to have it? And I think one World thing Cup is in June. The Pro Am starts March 23rd. Ah. If Trick Room tries to EMP, then dive Vega, CJ might be able to get there in time and provide that nano boost to protect Vega's life. There you go on the high ground. Not as easy to dive as it may seem. In fact, he seems incredibly hard to get to. For Trick Room, they've got two supports of here, but nothing else. The EMP from pretty far back. How are you going to engage on this? How do you actually get on top of Saints? They, they make nothing of the EMP. Didn't even have to invest anything back in the other direction. They're getting picks. They're still pushing forward. In fact, it's maybe going to die. It is going to die. Is seeming like an unstoppable force. Wait, J3, team. it's my birthday. Can I gift you? Ultimates. You want to gift me for Nothing your birthday? For no, bro. Happy birthday, horizon. man. How do you get Feels birthday, man. Here. Clap. Almost impossible, especially now that Saints are going to have everything available. Trick room still. I don't think have Infected's going to need a change. Get off ball, go Winston or something. Yes, they're going to have Transcendence, but Transcendence can't protect you once Biotic Grenade comes in from CJ, and we've seen how aggressive oh, he can what be. A... But a pick there. Yeah, I don't think the ball is working uh, out for him no, anymore. Test Tashino, Test Chio, appreciate the rest of four months. <laughs> 3k on Zenyatta, bro. They are peeling so now, fucking now. hard for their From Zen. Two and a half minutes. Uh, almost two and a half minutes, too. To spare. What a push, Eric. That was monumental in proportion. And it felt like Trick Room. Everything they did put up a little bit of pressure, but was toppled easily by the experience and raw power of Saints. Yeah, and I don't want to hear anymore that main supports can't aim. Vega absolutely ran through. Who had appreciate the mess and get this up, my friend? And there, I mean, that is a main support player. That is A B G S. I appreciate the mess up, friend. So how do you say your name? A bap. And here he is on a Zen, aim centric character, and just dumpstering the lobby. It's funny when when you think of C J and Vega and like their flexibility. Wait, there's no way A B G S means and playing double main support. Yeah. Double flex support was no. never like going the other direction. Something now. you thought about them <laughs> with ever. Even even when we look to like Circuit Royale and stuff with the uh, 
Bab Zen, it was like, that was definitely there, but having Zen and Ana here for them, it's uncharted territory, but they're cruising over it. I wonder how much this as well comes from the fact that there was that BAP Zen era kind of thing where CJ, I mean, clearly one of the best BAPs that is in the region has been for quite some time. And maybe that makes sense why Vega has had a lot of t opportunity. To I swear bronze ults take takes so much Zenyatta longer to fill up. Well, that's because the, experience the difference between there, these lobbies and bronze like lobbies is there. that these people can actually hit now their shots. Bronze lobbies, here, like, you know, you're missing so many more shots. The less damage you do, the, gonna be a sigma here the less ult charge defense, you're going to do, and the longer it's going to go take. The same route as their attack. And I don't see any reason why not to. I mean, protecting that backline, I mean, absolutely is working. If it ain't broke, don't fix it. In in layman's terms, you're very much to it. Think they're gonna stick yeah, I don't know why Infected well is them. still running ball against the, the Sombra pick and, and the D.Va. I think he should go D.Va himself so he can help peel his supports. Or go Winston so he can shoot through the defense matrix. Real meat and potatoes of A is coming up. See who wants to get the action going for us here. First pick could help determine things just like Already 89, appreciate the massive prime sub. Swapped earlier. Infected clearly having a tough time of things though, as he's gonna go down and still so much support over to Vega as you can see him playing so aggressively unfortunately oh, yeah 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 bro trick room is literally CJ. just getting rolled man right next to him already I love how CJ was kind of hiding What's really up, effectively Games are going well. for the first time around but the second time around the second boat got like a whiff of him it was all over <laughs> infected now fighting it through gets a better dive than his opposing tank and Saints have been warned off at least for a moment so trick room start pushing their way forward Things not looking too bad at all for them. They needed this. Beef up that morale a little bit. Saints walked through them on their yeah, attack, but now Trick Room looking a lot better. Now very close to capturing point A, but here come the Saints. Dives in the hack onto Hanbei. Great peel by Mateball though to make sure the Zenyatta stays alive. Now it's Trick Room's turn to fight back, and it's false out of mech. Nothing left to contest this point. Tree can stay, but the whip of magic Mateball has no mercy. Shuts it down, takes him to a point B, and with a sizable time bank, arguably way better than what they had against Redbirds. Oh yeah, this is looking far superior, and it's against Saints as well. Now, Trick Room have been able to manage that first cap just through dive synergy alone. I mean, they didn't really use anything. Infected was under a tremendous amount of pressure, but ultimately it didn't really account to much. I mean, Infected was able to get out more often than not, and now Trick Room have so many choices. As you see False looking to spy check, they need to find Pummy if they want to get a better EMP opportunity into this first fight here. <laughs> He's trying to like ping him. Made it this far back. Uh, Infinite, appreciate the massive 23 months. Kind of oh no. Oh, they woke him up! Oh my god, he's such a fucking lucky so ass player. I, Pummy better thank his lucky stars. If they take King out afterwards, it'll have been a blessing in disguise that Pummy was there to actually help do it. This is a better engagement than Trick Room could have ever created for themselves. Yeah, they killed the teleporter, or rather, Pummy specifically killed that teleporter and got out alive of some miscommunication between CJ and Vega, which literally never happens. This might be the first time we've seen that in like six months. Pulse out trans. Still forced oh, transcendence, forced. even though he missed, even he still forced it. For Trick Room. They're getting everything they could ever want out of these engagements, but they haven't gotten final blows yet, which is very important. Oh, uh, they nailed the Zen again. The Wait, that you started. Uh, hello? What? Oh, what? boy. What? Why is this a predicament? What? Uh oh. We, uh, what? Uh, we Did they reset before. the match? We know how this generally goes. Well, they reset the match. Uh, we are in a pause this right is now. N -A. Just to kind of give everybody an update. N A uh, the casting. Looks like the server dropped for a second there, and it is in a pause right now. I'll tell you what. Here's what we're gonna do. We are gonna be sending things to a quick break. Two thousand years later. How much longer? I don't know, bro. I. I'm a streamer. You think you think Blizzard tells me anything? The last time I ever talked to Blizzard, I was like, back, "Hey, we oh my God, it's back!" We figured out what was on the back end. We got everybody, Blizzard admins and everything involved in the. Last time I said guys. anything to Blizzard, they WH Omega me. They asked me if I Look, actually even streamed their games. They thought I was like a fucking Valorant streamer. Both teams had good pushes going for them, so I suspect they can do it again.
yeah, we'll have to see what both the teams are going to be capable of. We're going to be starting from ground zero as if nothing happened. Oh, Get they're resetting here. the whole game. Zero, now, zero. No little, time bank fresh let's, game, let's bro. Let's some reminders. Let's, let's refresh everybody's memories. And I just want to let you guys downtime. know before they even start, this they, they took like a 10, 20, like 25 minute break. Everyone has basically not been playing. So this is, ooh. Ooh, this is like basically calling a timeout before the kicker kicks the ball for the field goal to win. They're basically icing. They just all got iced. Yeah, it was that peel from false that really did it. Trick Room's usual tricks were no longer doing exactly what they needed to. I think Trick Room has become a lot more wary of that, though. Playing carefully, working towards those ultimates, and trying to play more of a macro game. Yeah, I think Trick Room are smart to play this a little bit slower. Make sure that they don't go for these super eccentric, aggressive dives trying to make sure that they can take out someone like CJ or Vega without really recognizing, okay, this is a grand opportunity before doing so. 30 seconds now into the round here. Saints setting things back up, getting right back into those same default positions and once again diving into the back line. Exactly where we expect them to be. Vega targeted initially, but the aggression shifts over towards CJ and that works out well for Trick Room who we'll pick off both the supports and force back Saints. Saints in the meantime, though, One thing I really don't like about that really, long pause really quickly, is that they probably came up with a lot of strats on how to counter each other's there, team. Sure so they're probably going to be diving Vega a shit ton, try to kill him, because Vega seemed like a very... Through the use of that they, they weren't really killing him a lot last Tommy round. Also working his way into the back line, looking for one of those isolated targets. It is going to be either one of these support players, and they're separated now here as well. Uh, sure. <laughs> okay. The one, I guess. Okay. And they got the pick. Can't argue with results. That's one for one now, but the other support in a lot of pain. Magic Maple does make it back to that hacked health pack, though, from Pummy. And now regroup Trick Room are going to have a small spawn advantage. To try and go for that dive again. See as well, CJ getting forced into the side here, but is well protected by the shielding of these walls in this room here. But now EMP expended. Saints need to return fire. The EMP is about 15% faster than Kings. It's a big opportunity for Trick Room to take down False despite the nano boost. And remember, still beat out the tank. Remember, the chat. It's King up to a Saints EMP capped this so fucking fast last round. Now oh, they're not. The they had five CJ minutes to go in the second phase or something, own, or something so ridiculous. Four upright. minutes. Now they, don't, they didn't even cap and they only have two minutes left. Mech charge was certainly really close to actually getting back into mech. Unfortunately, falls to the wayside, so. Now, got two hide. minutes. Yeah, I mean, uh, so far back. It also makes them more vulnerable to a dive to begin with, though. The threat of forcing out that trance is very real. King's gonna back away. Is anyone in here? Here's important break. interaction. Brings no back on Hummy, kicks him off! Oh my god, what a sick little play from the Zenyatta. That buys a lot of time for the rest of Trick Room. And on top of that, it doesn't have to utilize the transcendence either. Buying even more time for Trick Room, which is important here because now they can actually uh, stabilize this fight. The EMP is decent, but it didn't catch Hanbei. It didn't catch the Transcendence. Trick Room gets to re-stabilize and try and engage. Yeah, that but defense matrix is literally so and strong to protect really the Zen. Wary of King land that Maple down, Hanbei down. Vega I think the Saints are going to cap this though. Sure oh no, that EMP when they're already down so too. Come on, Pummy. It's a lot from Pummy to try no, and hold on to this point. No. It's just not going to be fruitful. What are they Sasa doing? Against Redbird. It's not going to happen this time, though. Saints do push their way through. <sighs> Reminder, though, that it's all about maintaining this momentum here in Trick Room. Not going to be giving up very much space for them to do that, but certainly all that damage that Vega is going to get through their rotations is going to help absolutely catch up very quickly, especially if they can keep Vega, con I mean, continually safe. They're doing a decent job, but remember, the cart's got to move the entire time, and there is some contest that could come on the tree. King picking off boat now eliminates that pretty significantly. And the position looks great for Saints, who have pushed Infected off the high ground and claimed vision over much of point B. In the meantime, as well, Saints still pushing this payload and not having to spend all too much here. On top of that, King very close to the EMP. This is... Certainly oh. looking like a potential fight winner. Oh, a great sleep oh. there. The setup is oh my. followed up with infected falls. Saints can easily push forward now here as well. Do Trick Room have time to wait for that wrecking? I think they do. They've got one more in here if they don't get picked off, but that's easier said than done. You're also pushing into almost every single ultimate at Saints' disposal. And I don't know if Trick Room, I mean, they have to find a pick or it's, there's just no shot. 
Here's the dive from Saints. The pulse bomb misses. They're surviving. Ultimate These pulse bombs look like mine, dude. These kicks have been incredible, man. Tree down. The bomb forced out as well here. There's a moment of reprieve for Trick Room, and that gives them time to pull the rally. Oh, the hack coming in as well. They're looking for what? something. Jay Magic looks like a porn actor helping. teacher yeah, right now. Is that just me? Forward as well. The EMP comes out. They find the kill onto Pummy, and now they're looking for Infected. I mean, King just got Pummy, though, to be fair. It shuts no, down a potential my name is EMP not Jay Sins, bro. Well, How are you doing, Skills? The Sama come back. Infected can't land a slam either and hacked out. He takes more damage than even Hanbei can react to. Saints finding those kills that they need to. Once again, another investment of that nano boost to Vega helps to solidify some of those okay, kills. Okay, so Saints is still okay. They're moment. still able to push it. Saints now. We do have their transcendence available. Certainly a lot less time than I think they're yeah, used to having in these situations. Yeah, a lot less time. Last last time they played this, the they had from Trick Room. They had two minutes and twenty seconds and they capped everything. Now they have two minutes and twenty seconds to cap all of fucking should third. Should come out and making sure that the rest of Saints are in a position where they can be saved. If Pummy is looking for an isolated target, Trick Room having a real hard time dealing with this Sombra. Oh, King, they're used to dishing it out and not taking it, Herix. Infect has been hacked every single time he's made the engage, but the slams haven't landed. EMP's gonna have a hard time landing. Oh, but not the shots from Hanbei. That's the opener they've been looking for. Big pick there on Vega, who has been a playmaker on this Zenyatta, taking him out certainly helps trick room get rid of quite a bit of lethality from saints roster and now on top of everything pummy is getting into position for another emp they actually do spot him i think for a moment there Hack oh he was hacked out of the emp it was perfectly timed by king wait taking away a critical ultimate from the pockets of trick wait room. did they hack they actually Steaming hacked it. emp leaving it conniving trickery on the side of saints whatever words you want to use they bought themselves a massive win how are trick room gonna fight their way back in this they've got a pulse from they got nothing else false dives into the back oh, line no Sorry. way no way oh, no, no way it restarted again that any of that happens to be our server today oh no there's no the way there's opposite of what you want this is the last possible thing there's no way right, i'm doing it again we're not going to waste too much time here trying to figure out exactly what Again! to do here. As Again! you know, I think clearly we're in another one of those situations here, Dora, where we're going to have to rely on an admin yet again. And we're going to go to a quick break. Hopefully, when we come back, we'll have a good answer it's about what's again, going on and bro. how to get past it. We'll see you soon. One eternity later. Welcome back, everybody. We think we've got a solution up and ready. We're going to continue this series tonight. There's a lot of flanking routes. There's places to hide, but I think you may want things to be at least to a degree a little bit more open, at least as long as you're not trying to approach a backline that's you know 500 miles away. We okay. Anyway, sorry. Wait, this we took a long break. Okay. Uh, so they're still running the diva. I mean, they didn't change team, tanks. The they're still it's both running sombras and tracers, but you Although, know, trick room is still running quarter, the zen the brig while saints is running the ana zen. Curious flank here. That's one way to try and assault the high ground. It's not a particularly successful way trick room holds strong stabilizing for the time being this is what trick room was looking for and now of course another thing for saints to kind of be aware of is oh what a fucking five war from vega right? that that is his zen gap gapity gap as you could possibly get he just gave him the beans no toast dude we're not in eu wait look at this now so what did he just say beautifully boat falls pummy next to go how do you really hold this card now it's like pummy's gonna be offering up at least something and it actually is okay. gonna come up with a kill on the tree and now in fact it can come back in they have four up soon to be five as well as uh, or sorry boat is almost there there's a strong contest here, but Trick Room are having a hard time finding a proper engagement despite the early I love this map. Got. Rialto is such a great map. I love Rialto. Again, just walks at him and takes him down. This is looking good for Saints. They've got that spawn coming in that they lost earlier. Infected down. The contest is hard, and Trick Room are falling by the wayside. Just like that, Saints. There's no a, way. There's no way Trick, Trick Room still they brings this back. Last few kills. Otherwise, Trick Room could stall and. No, false is gonna use. Oh my! That's a big EMP. EMP. That's a massive that. EMP. And more than big enough. Pummy and Boat hit the deck. Infected wasn't hit by it, but 
spawn advantage is not enough to make massive up for fucking EMP, and they still there. kept two olds too. Damn, that was a big one from King. So Saints come away with the first objective here. See also Trick Room starting to look like they're swapping at least a few things up here. As Pummy goes down. That is who I was mentioning. Sun that, that's Cassidy good. Brought in. Same here. Certainly good at marking some of these flanking heroes. The Sombra from King, the Tracer from Tree as well, and also can provide a little bit of burst potential as well with that new E in Overwatch 2, right? I'm wondering what happened to Tree there. <laughs> Everything is okay. All they need to do is just make sure the cart's pushing past this corner and then the real fight can start for this high ground. I hand it to both though, he's doing a good job of contesting here and just ripping time off the clock more than anything else, especially when Saints have the ultimate set. They do that, time's valuable for Trick Room being able to build up to match, especially with the position they have, they, they should be able to convert this. Nice nade, nice nade to Vegas kill some of the mines, but they no transcend this anyways. Oh, great sleep dart, actually caught infected there. So now Saints can push forward and they won't get just mauled around by that wrecking ball. A ball down though, on me to follow the anti-nade was actually huge from CJ. It denied the transcendence any value. Three minutes now. Saints continue to push forward here. Transcendence, yeah, I got. I didn't even see there, that they used nade. I didn't. Even... Cannot seem to find these kills. Saints. I was looking at the nano diva the whole time. I don't know. Protected. You know what CJ I really wish? I wish. Well I wish. There's an EMP they gave they content drops. creators like myself like the ALGS shit from Apex, so I could like join their comms and listen to their comms or spectate who I want to spectate. That would be pretty cool. By anything, the, the swells of their pushes forward. Vega is literally fucking monsters. rolling right now, bro. This guy is like the MVP of this team. Certainly a few waves to look back on, you know, at this point on this escort, but Trick Room certainly need to find a way to get oh. this stop and at least, hey, <laughs> Okay, that, never mind. I'm, I'm just never going to say anything right? again, chat. I mean, Wait, he's going to switch. On Vega. He's going to go back, though, and make a swap. They're completely shifting now focus to the Reinhardt. Infected doing a good job stopping the hacks, and honestly, you have to think. Infected's ball is good, but th this is where the comfort lies. And I think on this last point, it's perfectly viable. Trick Room want to stop those hacks coming through, want to stop the efficacy of that Sombra, and it's a fantastic way to. Grouping up around this corner. Text to speech is on, but not if you post forever, the link. I appreciate the massive dono, but now, I'm not going to watch that link right now. We're watching a Trick tournament. Room holding on the cart, boat denying tree any space, and now at the rally, Trick Room looking to move forward. What a stick. Oh, big pulse bomb. Magic mate balls down. Rally. That's a lot of, oh, that's a lot of the support. The rally gone as well. Yeah, the, the rally falls away from mate ball. The stick was massive, and without it, Trick Room topple over. Are we still 249, just keeping our eyes on that one. Saints are looking to reproduce a push from Junker Town that they wanted back, and they're going to probably get it here as long as they can get Vega's Transcendence online that can help support them in their push forward. Trick Room Ooh, needs to find some three ults coming in. That, and that's going to be a hard gonna... for anyone. That I was hacked. Short lived for Pummy, who's now being dove by two members. Immortality Field working overtime right now for Trick Room, but it does get the job done. Transcends to the back line, gives a new lease on life to this dive from Saints, though. And with that extra time, no way. No, I mean, they, they had the ults. It's yeah, two minutes and 13 oh, seconds, man. <laughs> it's, it's, it's right there. Especially when you consider, too, that Trick Room, I mean, they were kind of late to the party with that Reinhardt composition, but that is one composition that on this map, particularly point A, point C, certainly point C, you actually really like to see that composition there. It actually does work out really well. There's some linear nah, sections. Vega, some Vega is literally right like you. rolling right now. You, that's a very tough composition to actually win out against. And Trick Room just pulled it out a little bit later than I would have liked. They didn't really have time to, you know, get a stop, build Economy. some momentum, and start rolling yeah. ultimates. I'm curious to see if they start with that now. I think we have to be starting to question the ball a little bit. They definitely do look better on attack with it. The defense is raised a lot of questions of, of the efficacy of this composition. But do the they ever show their stats? Sadly, good. no. It's not great. That's I think fair. There, yeah. there are grounds for still running. Granted, we only got glimpses at their attacking sides, but for the two times that we saw, like, it, it was solid. They were setting good times. I, I don't think there's any reason to swap it here, at least. 213. Just like you mentioned, on Rialto, just genuinely a, a, a solid time. One that Trick Room are going to be 
hard pressed to try to match her or beat. Not to say that they can't, but with this wrecking ball composition, they have to kind of run through Saints, which is, I mean, basically okay, chat, the Saints take did. your bets. I mean, they is the game going to crash? Yeah, your name. Almost every single one of them actually to be able to establish that time in the first place. And we know that with these compositions, especially with the wrecking ball, I mean, these fights take a long time to actually resolve. We see them broken down. There's chaos, there's brawling. It just takes time. Yeah, finishing a map with these respective compositions on the field is even harder than it would be with something like Rush versus Rush I kind of wish they spectated Vega longer. a little bit more. Vega is literally Jason like just rolling right now. They put so much support Trying into Vega stripper, as well. No assail forward, nevertheless. Infected falls though, and with what that, their, uh, for being their assault is... A Shinobi, appreciate the massive get this up, my friend. Anymore. You see that teleporter position as well for King to fall back, ready to defend the back line or fall back to their welcoming arms should he need the help instead. Great positioning yeah. here for Saints. I, mean, I don't think Trick Room is going to so win this map. I don't this know why, but I feel like the Diva gets so much more uh, value than the, the, the Wrecking Ball. <laughs> Funny but enough, I don't think Infected <laughs> knows how to play Diva as <laughs> feels, well feels as False. That, that, that name all of a sudden, I don't know why. But uh, but tr Trick Room are, are kind of experiencing some of that same issue crop up here in this matchup where that back is so hard to get Six to. 6 HP, holy shit. It's so insulated between these walls, and I think the real trouble is actually not necessarily being in the song. Oh, the uh -oh. tracer, one HP, GJ's down, drops from the safety of the high ground. The warm embrace of a roof floor and walls was not enough to keep him alive once he hit the deck. Now it's about finishing out. Oh, the nice the dodges on the fucking hacks. God those. damn, but that. Oh, the tracer was one HP though. High ground, and they just can't reach them all. Yeah, and they're not even able to push the payload forward at all, too. And now Trick Room forced to back up a big kill on the tree. They actually tried to bite off a little bit more than they could actually chew. This Vega's is gonna be corner. falling back. This is, a, <laughs> yeah. this is a fight one for Trick Room at this point, and I think really just off Why the Why aren't they tree, wearing their team colors? A little bit, Chat, uh, these aren't Overwatch League well. teams. Saints overheated for a second. They have five ults. Actually, this is kind of contestable. When you've got a bomb, like, you can throw balls at this five. card and not feel okay, bad about it. Yeah, there's the EMP, Deadeye. And King's oh, also really, uh, is, we're talking about Vega a lot, but King's also doing really good on the Sombra for the EMPs. And Falls is actually re doing really well with the, Even better for Saints as you know, well as the fact that we preventing a lot of deaths in like the, the defense oh, matrix. In fact, found a pick. They still Let need their it. supports to come back. They still need their supports to come back. Yeah, uh, to be honest, it's just that difference, right? With Hanbei and Maple on those respective supports, it does take a while. Yeah. Yeah, not not too much speed to be had. There. Why is Imagine there only five players? Just kind of shield bash, but that's not gonna offer too much speed when Saints are just they spawn and they're just in sight line already. Both teams had a DC. I spy check by both. Where's the real dive here? Like we said, you gotta find CJ and Vega. They've got a nano boost. And a they keep nanoing. Yeah, they really want to keep Vega up. They keep nanoing every time one infected like dives. Down falls. It's a tank trade, which is way better for Trick Room, giving them the space to take the cart. You may not have to kill the backline, but you gotta give your hat off to infected. Pulled the tra or pulled the nano. Didn't pull the trance, but pulled more than enough attention away. Yeah, massive play. Not only that, but also separated the back line to make sure that False, I mean, really couldn't get any support. CJ and Vega were both turned trying to deal with the uh, Wrecking Ball, and the Wrecking Ball just has a little bit more personal survivability and elusiveness, certainly more so than the D.Va, especially when you see how much damage Trick Room were just throwing in at False. Now, of course, Trick Room on the high ground here. They're going to be looking to hold on to this, at least for the time being, while they are working that cart around the corner. We'll see this 1v1. Ooh, actually slipping by. It's going to be both. Oh, forces the trance out, too, with the pulse That's bomb. actually big. Three tries to hide that back line, but he's unable to obfuscate it. Hanbei, though, same thing goes, but he doesn't have a trance to save himself, or at least doesn't want to use it. What does Brig Undega add here? Brig? For what? For trick room? room? Brig and Zen is a Start strong combination. They both they both pocket each other and stick on, on top of each other, and they're literally it, impossible to dive. Not enough damage pressure to actually follow up on the Wrecking Ball. And plus, paired up with a Cassidy, a Cassidy Briggs Saints Zen, all, st all all on top of each Somehow, other, death falling. That's literally impossible. Ahead on that fight, and nonetheless, you see this time bank, and this is going to be something that I think 
certainly would have to Brig Zen has been meta for a very long time no I'm pretty sure they also with that time bank of 213 here on this map that's gonna be I mean a massive pressure on Trick Room's shoulders to try to get something relatively close so they still have oh this pulse bomb could be fucking massive this could be a massive pulse bomb this flank here by tree nobody chat take your bets yay or nay does he land it he does have that pulse bomb waiting for the right target spots pummy Blinks through, thinks better of it. Now the rest of Trick Room in front of him. He's got a lot of options, but isn't grouped up enough with his team. They want to find a pick. They need to do it while they're correct, corralled together. They are around infected. I guess they didn't up. need it. It's another sleep from CJ, who just has not missed him today. Granted, that ball is a big target, but nevertheless, man, it's hard to hit. Ah, that there you go. The is well tree is popping. Trick Room, despite the oh open, despite my. all the tools available, and there's going to be even more in the next fight. This push stops. I I don't know, man. Trick room. This next one. They have to be careful though, because if they do decide to go ahead and take Magic Mayfall's rally and do something, yes, with whispers. It, as we see, play here, the stick from Tree. I mean, finding the kill. Oh my god, base, dude. Oh my I mean, god. Trick room basically need to find something exactly like that, because that's what they're gonna have to contend with going into this next fight. Vega will have transcendence and therefore a lot of sustain, but you can one shot through it. If you land a pulse, or if you land some mines. You know, that fluidity that we always talk about with Trick Room, how they're able to move around teams and set up for dives constantly. It's not really been there. Yeah, yet. man. I think Infected has been doing well tonight, but I think he needs to get off the ball here, in my line. opinion. I don't know. Go Even Winston, Minch, go Diva or something. Three, four people on top of him. Tainted's dive has been phenomenal in its ability to target out specific players. Oh. And this time, it's probably infected again. 500 health on the top high ground. Oh, a Discord orb as well. He's feeling the hurt, but he doesn't go down thanks to the rally of Mayball, who storms forward, keeping the car going. Saints will just leave. Abscond, ignore the ultimate from the Brigitte and look to re-engage with an EMP. Here it is. King drops it on the back line. Maple, Hambe fall, sustain gone. Trick Room. And they still have Diva Bomb, and they still have Tracer Pulse, yeah, and they have Nano coming up. Yeah, Trick Room well. has the nothing. They're done. And they almost have, they almost have both support uh, DPS, but they're not going to have it. Out of situations like this before, but not this time. He leaves, and so do the chances of Trick Room taking this map. Saints get the win, and guess what? We're moving past Escort. We've done it. We've Woo! done it. We've finally, done it. This, was, this was not just a team effort. This was and a family We are effort. finally like done I've with Escort, bro. It's been so like an well. hour, hour and, and a half. Jerks, you're like a brother at this point. It, it, oh, it really Meldino, appreciate the match in three months. Fair enough. I'm just, I'm a little bit upset that you didn't feel like that before. Trick Room, yes. coming into Esperanza, they've got the Rhine locked in. So they would wear oh, uniforms uh, in the school break. It's it not like I went to the gym today, bro. The the I could have been literally on Friday. The, the last the day I went to the gym was Friday, so it was probably a school day, and now they have spring break. So yeah, fuck you, idiot. They probably went to school and then finally got out and then went to the gym. Waleed, you're literally Canadian. Stop talking to me. All right, let's see what it can accomplish here. Trick Room, not opting forward the May, the traditional pick of this Reinhardt composition. Instead, have both on to the Tracer. And I'm not, gonna offer you don't know when RNA spring break is. Uh, the ability to mark King, and that might be something that they're actually explicitly looking to accomplish against Saints. Yeah, just stopping that flank, stopping that dive triangle. Tracer more effective than the May for them in this situation. Pummy dropped low, though, as the dive comes in. Mikey wants no! his soul, but it's Pummy. No! Literally, someone in chat said it's next week, and it's two weeks long for you guys. It's not the same as us, bro. Pulling a, a card out of Saints' book, even. Saints turning this one, though, a little bit. Vega goes down. Still a couple of members up for Saints. So what I imagine this is going to actually amount to is just less distance covered by the push from trick room it's the first week of march fight, no it's not bro sometimes it's the yeah, last it's the first week seven. of april too <laughs> yeah, it's, it's different i home about but trick room will take what they can get right now small victories for this team they've got to build them up as they round the corner stopping king from getting around the side is going to be harder bro i hate talking like to you then, then, then leave the Sticky lands onto Mikey. The pressure. We're trying to watch a very room. high octane gameplay right now. The backline likely pinged by a teammate. Immediately seeks him out. Trick room going to try and fight back with this amplification matrix. And Pummy firing through it does exactly enough. No support line means no fight for Saints. There are very few ways to win this now. Very few. Very few indeed. Trick room. 
Looks like they're going to solidify that fight when Ooh, Saints, though. What's actually really interesting here is, uh, you know, one team's running the Sojourn, one team's running the, the Cassidy. The different elements that they bring forth. That they I'm glad it's not a mirror contest. matchup though. Reinhardt so and Winston and Kiriko Kuru. with Baptiste. Not gonna get a ton of distance before Saints are on top of them, throwing down Katsune Rush and trying to yeah, smother them. A bad patch of Mari. I appreciate the massive seven months. Can they withstand it? Can they find the peel they need? And Squish, appreciate the, the massive like two months. Available high ground, no longer so. Trick room flipped the map. What an interesting take on how to play this. The shatter lands the stick on the pummy. Ignore the high noon actually got a kill. TJ Ain't even. no way, bro. Really creative stuff coming out from Trick Room. This is what you need. 12 hours deep into an Overwatch tournament, but it might not no, be No, entries literally off. popping off now. No. Boat trades it back. It's two for two no now. way. No way, Mikey. No fucking shot, dude. No way. Cart flip. Saints win. That was an insane well team fight. Room. It's just not enough. I mean, the star power of Saints proves once again to be insurmountable. Trick Room are going to have to continue making, I mean, genuinely great plays like that if they want to have a, a chance at all. But even still, it becomes difficult. Got a few more tools this time. It took everything from Saints. It was every ultimate from them all. Player with the ultimate for Trick Room falls. Hanbei is being sent back to spawn. Maple to follow. They've got to go count their sheep once again. Yeah, yeah I mean, man. As much as I want Trick Room to win, it because just, I think that the, they're the uh, underdog, I think Saints is going to win. Group, just to kind of unsettle that setup from Trick Room as they rotate in. And as soon as that shield stops covering even just one member of Trick Room, then that player just gets booped off, isolated, and now Saints take the lead and are starting to get closer to a position where they can actually start taking advantage. I feel, of I feel from just lead. watching this However, so far, Trick without Room knowing any sure of these teams, I feel like have Saints have more star out. power and more. There's more people on well, Saints that are Mikey's able to like carry and make individual plays point, than Trick Room. Alive. I don't know where he went. He's got to have found some hole that nobody knows about. Either way, eventually we'll die to vote. The rest of the team will keep this cart going. Flip it around for Trick Room. They've got ults. They've got momentum, Yurks. Can they keep it going? 16 meter deficit. Looking to go ahead, get back to neutral. Not capped out there by the Saints, though, and that's going to be important. Saints not going to have that respawn. I don't believe it was taken. It might have actually been. We've made that mistake before, but don't believe so. Nonetheless, Trick Room, they do have that shattered. Nothing to block it. Hanbei, actually, great job to. Oh no, my boy Dumbly infected. Oh, Come on, man. It just could not land. Tree's got Hanbei. And now you're locked in a room with five Saints players poking at you from any side. This is as rough a situation as they come. Tricker, we're going to have to fight their way out of anything. And they're beginning to. But without Boat, doesn't seem very possible. Yeah, infected can try as he may to charge his way out of this one, but absolutely swarmed. Still, managed to equalize quite a bit, and we still see this going back and forth, back and forth. But Saints are now pushing into Trick Room territory once again. They still have that lead, but they're also going to have, I mean, a completely packed list of ultimates to throw in onto Trick Room. And the main thing here is that a lot of this pressure could easily go any which way. Saints don't have one target that they kind of have to focus on to win a fight. They can just throw up the Katsune Rush and dive on anyone. Everyone's got to be careful on Trick Room. This is the push that could win Saints the map. If they mess it up, it could be the one that loses them the map all the same. No. Ultimate's dropped in from above. This is actually Investing still really close. Both teams only pushed it 50 That's meters. Sure. Sound barrier late from 45, 50. And in fact, it catches the rest of the team. Trading out for Tree, but there's still a problem. Mikey's alive. Kept so by the immortality field is Hanbei, but Sound Barrier was just too much to tackle. Saints spend two ultimates. In a very important fight, but that card push matters a lot. Uh, Ghostly yeah, Taco, appreciate that as a prime. as well out from Trick Room, but Saints are still going Dude, this, this is looking well bad for three, Trick Room. And with ultimates? this, the card stops here for oh, eight close. seconds, while Trick Room has, like, you know, the other team has know, eight seconds of instant respawns, it. but it they have really three risky. fucking ults. Trick Room has nothing. Well, they so almost have two. Doing it. Yeah, this fight's no easier as well. Saints, so many tools to push in with. Mikey immediately dies, takes a boatload of damage. 
pops oh wait a minute the primal rage but with tree down from the dive things get a lot harder who's gonna finish off all this primal rage damage that mikey's doing wait that was a good little transition right there wait a minute he's back one Wait a minute, infected, well. infected. Back. And with the robot already moving across the map, a delayed pick on the Mikey means big progress for Trick Room. Yeah, oh, and that means Mikey doesn't get forward well. spawns. I mean, Reinhardt, but I mean, he's Winston. So oh, he's well. Oh, Mikey on, on the wrecking ball. Wait, I, we haven't seen because, this. I mean, what are you really Chat, how's Mikey's like wrecking ball? Mirror, I didn't watch Overwatch League. Still was able to land his hammer onto a few targets, key ones at that, to help finish the fight. And now they're looking to actually equalize here, and he has the shatter to help them. Oh, he could go for it here. He could just pop it on the tree. I mean, that's uh, it, for sure. It's almost always worth it. He Wait. missed wide from behind Wait, the robot. It's hard to see. They need to push the robot up as far as they can go. Remember, the Wait, this, this guy has this guy has the J3 game right now. Wait a minute. The robot from moving forward. The trick room. Rain on the Parade of Saints by just dealing damage constantly. Mikey low avoids the charge but catches a sticky. It's an air rush out for CJ. Can they convert? Yeah, but this is actually oh, really no. bad. It's actually rush. really. Trick room. Not only have one. They're gonna fight, get into spawns. They're, they're gonna, gonna get into spawns. And they're gonna take this is a really a fucking close here. map. The really the I bad thing though is that Saints are gonna have their ultimates before fight. Trick Room. Past this choke point. So Saints not in a good defensive position and certainly not with a lot of time. An ideal amount of time for them to win this fight, take it back to neutral, oh, win another no, fight, and extend. Oh! Uh, it just stayed too long. I mean, there's nothing else to it. Triple blinks away. Could have gone down the hallway, maybe, but uh, I think, but, uh, I think Boat will come back quick. He has forward spawns. Infected now. Half to tank for a team with only four players. They want to take this fight forward. If they're going to die anyway, nah, they, they they're might both as well are, are already back. They back. can take the fight. Pummy also got down, a huge pick on Tree. The pulse bombs lobbed out. King's yelling Kobe in the comms, but unfortunately, not quite the same level of accuracy. Down barrier engagement now from Saints as they look to re up themselves in the fight, but there's not much left. There's a, there's oh, big slam! Big slam! Big slam. The shatter, namely, the first of them. Oh, he finally man, got a good slam. He finally got one. Really? Nothing to block it now. I mean, even the Winston is gone, and that even is a far cry of trying to be able to block. But nonetheless, Saints still stabilizing somehow through the use of. Oh, Mikey. that was a nice this shot. Well, you guys saw that? Gets caught by him. I, that was a nice I shot. Were playing this correctly. They don't need Big two, two shattered. This fight. They See, have a lead. that's they actually have a something that you guys actually they don't understand. Yes, Saints two man shatter is a huge slam. Right you do, now. you do they realize to win this fight. And I think that's solo ulting someone move. and making your team go up yeah, in a four v five situation can change team fights, right? Now remember, Saints. Yeah, I think you don't. You don't need to wait room, for that remember, perfect five man fucking ult. If you keep looking for that or trying to go for that, you're just gonna fucking lose your games. I mean. They're, they are going to be able one to or two kills will objective. change they a whole fucking fight. Cap, so there isn't going to be that crazy downtime that you typically see. So this actually could be, actually will be, the final fight of this map. Mateball cannot die before getting that sound barrier off. That is. The oh, that's oh right now. wow! Oh, oh, Counterplayed by a Suzu. <laughs> smile. Out from both sides. Now what a great pulse bomb. Can he land it? Can he bring his team back up? No, infected falls. The sound barrier is too late. Trick room are fighting without a tank. The mines on. Oh no! Those are huge mines in front of the point. Nobody can get to the mines. How are they going to contest this? They only just do. But Pummy gives his life for a death blossom. The no way, oh, bro. They take themselves up to match point. So many things went right there for the Saints. The timings where they found those two picks on the boat that allowed them to put the cart in a, or sorry, the bot in a much better position to take some of these fights. Also, way prior to that, they had already capped out the first point. That gave them an opportunity to actually push past the choke and not have to fight their way. The mines in, in front of fight. the point for the last fight was so fucking I big. Mean, who else? <laughs> Obviously, uh, Neon, appreciate massive 500 bits. I, did I enjoy my daylight savings day? No, good. because I woke up at 12 and I thought but it was like 11. Finalists. Uh, Silversmith, appreciate the massive primes up as well. Knock out Redbirds and now be in this situation. They've got a map on Oh, Saints. one team's going coast, one team's going main. Get a second. They were so close already to getting a second. And here they are on the point looking for that early point presence. Take on Saints who do have that Winston competition. Infected is running. I'm, I'm, I'm surprised he's not running the wins, uh, the, the ball. He's running Ryan. They want to play Brawl on this map. What a bubble. I mean, what a, what a wall. 
All right, pull me back to the Bastion, though. Something that I definitely think we should talk about. We haven't seen this pick in hours. Since Redbirds dominated it on one map, they just stopped running it. But bringing yeah. it back out here, I think, is a great opportunity to kind of refresh the comp. Yeah, and for anyone that's just up, tuning yes, in sir. to Grand Finals, I mean, the way that this comp works, you effectively, you just set up, make make sure that everybody's in a position, speed. Oh, Saints up, are running Mercy up, Farah with a Gengu now and a ball. And now Saints, they've decided, okay, you know what? Let's make sure that they don't have any targets to do that too. Mikey going to be very slippery with this wrecking ball. They're sending people out Oh, that the Pharah's getting in some fucking Genji, heavy damage. No well. way. Oh, with the follow-up from Mikey as well. These rockets from Tree. Rain true. I mean, we talk about the far one tricks and you and, and stuff oh, like that. Oh, Man, my! The tree far also does hit a little different. Having this guy up your sleeve is no joke, and it's going to cap the point. Oh, well. my fucking God, dude. This looked real solid for them, too. I'm, I mean, it's been so long since we, <laughs> we've seen this map fit, or seen this uh, this comp choice. Twin. Remember, this, Appreciate the massive prime the as well, my dude. Same series that we're in right now. Do you ever miss Just the pro days, Jay? No. Maps ago. I love so, being a content creator. Less stress. For them there on Icebreaker. Now here One good thing about being a content creator is that you don't have a worry. You don't have to worry about getting mark. cut or fired. Justice from the back. Three managed to get one and uh, fight quickly ended with the help of CJ and an anti nade. Also, building your own community and growing Saints. your own content is like. Well with this I feel it's like a lot better here. Trick room, obviously making that adaptation. Yeah, let's go. Hanbei on the Kiriko. I like this. Also, this yeah, the Sombra really, really good pick helps them deal with King Tree, Mikey, Vega. Uh, Certainly gives them a lot of options than just trying Prime to sub, my friend. bash their head into a brick wall that is chasing someone around like Mikey or trying to apply damage from range to Tree, who is, I mean, literally miles away at this stage. I mean, when they the one thing map, I'm gonna go off topic here. That they brought out the one thing that pro players don't do, which CJ. they should do yeah, while they're being a pro, because pro game is pro pro play is not gonna last forever. What a great boot. They need to build their own brand. I think the only person that's actually successfully done it is Super while he was in the Overwatch League and, and like you know on, on Shock. What another great boot. Notice how he's not playing in the Overwatch League anymore, but he still grew his brand, grew his own stream where he's a big fucking streamer now and he doesn't need to worry about anything. Because it gives it, it, it basically yeah, disables the opportunity. XQC, for well, XQC became a meme. I think he wanted, yeah, I think he, he loved streaming. And well, I mean, momentum would getting banned from the Overwatch what, thing, getting banned for the Overwatch the League as XQC was just a, like a publicity stunt to grow his stream. Actually, a five head oh, move. Mints appreciate the massive prime as well. He better not. They know it's coming. He better not. Trick room. Max him off with. Two ultimates spent it. It's not a bad fight for Trick Room, to be honest. Yeah, not at all. Sure, four is also a really good one. Yeah, the exact same amount. They use that combo of. I just feel. I just. Blade, I just feel like. King just unable to find. If you're skills, in the league or any other pro game, okay, building so your own brand is just as important for. as you know the pro play. A lot of it. EMP at the ready for boat. Oh, backs away rather than oh, getting spotted out. Tree and Vega. Oh, they want. Uh, the oh, that's a good pick if you get the kill. The oh, same, that's a though. big pick. King Only one will second. die yeah. to it. Barrage picks up two though. Tree three in the fight. We've talked about. Oh, it. they actually get time, the kill. I, I think it is high time that we remember just how dangerous as far it can be. It wins maps. It's won a lot of tournaments. They could do this one for them. Remember, they are on tournament point, and they're looking to make a map point here. Maybe though. They can turn some There's around. no way. Trickle There's no way they turn this they around. Five. They're catching them lacking. Saints thought they had it in the bag. Yeah, without tree, there's, I don't really think a major hope in actually turning this, especially with all the damage that Trick Room still have on the table. But no the way they now, actually turned that, bro. I thought they were done when the Sombra really went to point and died the instantly. Sustain that they may need and to deal with that constant pressure, that threat. No! Oh, they might, oh just too late. Okay. The things they do have are good though. Like that shatter, what's gonna block it? That's true. Oh, this this is huge. This is huge. The Farah, they so have both support ults on the Saints, but infected is a land of fat fucking shatter, bro. Right and I mean a fat shatter. Into this map, infected knows what he wants. He knows what he's not, and he's not taking no for an answer. Blocks the sleep as well from CJ. Knows it's coming. Takes down tree. Pummy's managed to kill himself again. Wait, oh, Pummy? Pummy? This man can't catch a break, and he's gonna maybe wish he didn't, because the backline's chain healing. Overtime's burning down. It's gonna be a tough ask for Saints to get this one back. 
but they've got what a great suzu what numbers. that looks like another j3 pulse, pulse bomb bro maybe i shouldn't be come back maybe just maybe saints can turn this around Oh, uh, Vega just doesn't have the help that he needed. CJ just made a swap, but that means no he's back in the respawn. No way, bro. No way. Come room. on. Come on, oh, Trick man. Room. They've got themselves a round Come on, one. Trick Room. The fact that they What's actually it? brought it back and fucking <laughs> won that round, so I'm rooting. I want them to do the reverse sweep, bro. The if they play, come back and reverse sweep, fight, I will fucking scream without the S. I'm not sure Saints have offered up a realistic answer to this composition yet. With the Sombra included... That's looked consistent on control. Now when you move forward too, I'm starting to kind of, I'm already thinking about what's ahead, right? I mean, you look at gardens, I think that could pose a little bit of threat, at least with regards to what Trick Room did Oh wait, that here. actually, oh my but god, oh my. Map, right? That's not I mean, a reverse sweep, yeah, but they, they have okay, to win three games in a row. About how they got away with that one. That's funny. Shout out again to the replay. How many times that did we falls. said that yesterday? Appreciate no, a massive prime, my friend. Today. Yeah, our ops team's been been obs and as long as these players have been playing that has got to be so exhausting shout out them trick room though same comp same point they bring the sombra to start this time having learned from their past mistakes how will mikey respond he hasn't successfully been able to engage oh look this at this before. chat they're running now it's tree they're running winston with reaper himself alive a boat will sojourn shake and take away 30 percent of an emp while vega takes away a death Shot out by Pummy just from the back line. That is a straight up pick. Just good shooting from the Cassidy. Uh, Mikey's dead here as well. Oh, one I think I think Mikey is going to need to go Reinhardt. There's no way they're going to win this with a with a with a Winston. Won the neutral fight. I, I don't think this makes any sense. Winston. Okay, fair. <laughs> don't you look dumb? Maybe Ataraxia <laughs> or on uh, Antarctic Peninsula? Maybe. Trying to like, I mean, we're having to remember back multiple days at this stage. Just feels like this composition is just prone to getting picked early, and it sets them behind. However, a lot of healing given to CJ because of a lot of that pressure that they are receiving without that shield. Now they can start with it with this Katsune rush. No, that's gonna be a fat. That's gonna. That's huge. That's huge. That's huge. It hit all five, dude. But they're losing. No way. In trick room or trying to cut five man EMP to, to lose that team fight. Over. That's crazy. Hey, Saints, get control. It's just gonna be a matter of who is able. Oh, that's a Pummy. big pickup. Wait there. a minute, Pummy. Pummy's on something, dude. This guy is on one. They back up, wait for their tank. Oh, wow. That's okay, a high noon gets a kill. It's that's a W. High noon is useless. If it gets a kill, that that's a W. That much. Trick room recap a point that they called theirs. Just like that as well saints i mean they cannot push in we got a pause coming in and once again going to say this it's just a pause everybody calm down saints now approach knowing that they've got about two fights left in this point overclock available for tree no dangers can be the hack nearly lands Might come on by the way chat back. you guys should be on the edge of your seat bro trick room needs to win this so they're fucking saints out of the tournament and they get second place and saints win you guys gotta be at the edge of your seat, so man. Three, looking for that angle. There it goes. Overclock. Can he find those heads? Pummy's looking oh! for his own. Three connects. The disruptor shot just enough to find Hanbei. Infected looking to find his way back into the fight. Ah, oh, but he just doesn't have enough health or abilities to do it. The first picture of Saints too strong. It's still, still a huge stag uh, not stagger. Not stagger. Stall. Does spell good news thus far for the map. 86% to 20%. Is, okay, we always talk about this. Economy, efficiency. Those two things going hand in hand. Just how efficient can Saints be with what they have, the resources that they have? It's going to come down to picks. It's going to come back, come down to staving off EMP and also making sure that they can deal with this shatter that's going to come in from infected. It's, I mean, virtually unblockable. Especially uh, if they, if they, they have to hit a fat shatter here. I believe in infected. I believe in infected. Off the map. In but a moment's time, an insane little boop onto Infected stops him from shutting down. It doesn't matter, the fight's lost, but holy shit, King. the stop on that charge almost had him off the map. That, <laughs> That's exactly what they need. One single Death Blossom, now getting close to actually equalizing in this scoreline. Trick Room, though, are coming up on those weapons that we talked about. Pummy, Boat, Infected, Mateball's getting close as well to that sound barrier. Certainly, Trick Room are going to get one round with each. Oh yeah, no, the target. shatter inside the, the bubble! The Suzu's huge from CJ, and they counter strike. 
out comes the Kitsune Rush. Down go Trick Room. One more fight, but and we are on that's tournament fine. The Saints use three ults. The Saints oh, use man. three ults. Trick Room, trick room has one ult, uh, two ults. Have they can bring this Deadeye. back still if they play it smart. Spent everything to stick that fight out. They absolutely, desperately need to get away from this dead eye, or this fight is done, and this map is over. Oh, and they're running. They're running. They know it's on the other end of that bridge. Pummy needs to be careful not to be in a vulnerable position. Oh, they flipped it. They flipped, it. they flipped it. They flipped it. They still have oh, beat, and they almost have the window. The other team has absolutely nothing, process. unless Tree gets his ult really fast. Here. They can the actually win this with window. Himself. And beat. Just a moment in time. It's just about reacting to your teammates' health bars getting low. Implication matrix. It's the last fight. This is the last fight. To get a first pick. Throws it out. It's Mikey in a lot of trouble. Immortality out first, Mikey down, sound bear from Mateball, forward move for Shrek Room. And no fucking shot, we're going through another, another fucking map. Point back and send us into map number six. Or seven, or eight, but nonetheless. <laughs> They're gonna move oh us my what god, bro. Come on, man. We have Come on, on. I'm hands. rooting for the underdogs, the bro. Everyone wants Saints I mean, to win, and I understand Saints long. are a good fucking team, and they have a lot of good players, but I want are getting these the dubs, underdog to win. Who the MVP of the lobby is, or the play of the game was. They get to move forward. They get to have one more shot. Oh, man, I'm so a, glad I the mean, finals isn't a roll, like a 4-0, a 4-1 shutout. I want it to be a close one. I want it to be a good one. For that there you sniper, go, J3. Right? They I mean, shouted the you out. Wait, they in. shouted me out? Trick room. I mean, Wait, you what? Know that and, and it is, it is <laughs> less cooldown now because this is on the live patch. So They mentioned the people who are co-streaming. Oh, bro. It didn't say J3, bro. I'm a WHL mega low, bro. No one knows who the fuck I am. On the lunge is going to really, you know, bolster your defenses against a comp like this. Are, are you trying to tell me lunge is not as good as Sojourn Slide? Yeah. Uh, By the way, Noah yeah, appreciate the massive prime sub. <laughs> Philly appreciate the massive prime right, sub, and Swaggin appreciate the massive 200 bits. On the ropes still, turn it point for Saints, but oh, you take a breath there. If you're pummy, spots his head over the top too. His noggin's peeking. Chrome Dome is very visible in the sunlight of Junkertown. Next up is a tracer to bat. They gotta be real camp for all here. You're really just testing your luck by peeking pummy like this. MVP oh, fence. there we go. Okay. I, I'm oh, glad that we tree. see the Widow pick. Yeah, I want to see Widow. I want to see more Widows. We haven't seen a lot of Widows. Saints, and the Star Child is down for them. How are they going to win the fight now? Diamonds oh, that, would, that, had, that was the... They want that Zenyatta the defense matrix is not infinite. I'll tell you that much. Vega can fight for Oh himself, my, there you go, Pummy. There you pummy. go. Oh. Trace for CJ. Ignores the Tracer. He's done his job. Oh, and just like that, False actually loses his mech, so Hanbei, the rest of Trick Room, point can clean this up. Can they, though? Wait, this is actually I mean, really good for for, for Trick Room. No. So not... You'd think, man, it's just two people, but it's, it's Tree and King, so it's not just two people. <laughs> yeah, you might want to walk that one back a little bit, buddy. Uh, I don't think anybody saw Infected just hanging out. King could have... Gone for a pole spawn would have set them up. In a Wait, that's position, big. That's big. That's big. And off goes King's head. That is a massive advantage here for Trick Room. Boat can just come alive for basically free. The first four maps of this series were all first picks. Every nice fight shot, oh, dude. Trick nice Room shot. Got them handled. Nice Trans shot. To try and solidify this. Well, Pummy's on an open angle. They need to, they need to the go force cart. Force cart so the Widow has sight lines on it's people. It's just standing. This time it's not Tree and King that they have to worry about. They'll try nevertheless. A couple players left here for Trick Room to try and finish out the fight. The Transcendent sees them through time-wise. And the Diva staying alive is great, but who's going to deal with Pummy? They, to do they need that. to I get mean, cart, King man. They need to, to get cart. These other threats and he was down at the beginning of that last fight because of Hanbei, and now they haven't really been able to stabilize. There's the cap coming in for Trick Room. Obviously, a lot of That's actually really bad for the Saints, point. too. The Saints only have one ult, which is Hanzo, while all, Trick Room's going into this with three fucking uh, ults. I mean, certainly putting Saints off kilter is a good way, a good method of finding your way forward. That's exactly what Hanbei was able to they're, accomplish they, by taking down So, so technically, to to do on that, paper, Trick Room should continue to win this point for free. The they have... He's no longer on the Widow. Doesn't need all those resources. Instead, the Sombra. Okay, maybe I need... Okay, I'm locking that uh, one. Hypers, appreciate the massive prime. <laughs> he does go down, but there's a silver lining here. All that time that they gave up at the very end of point A so that Saints could get their last hold... Yeah, well, never mind. Cost to Saints, right? They got the time off the clock, but look at the ultimates, man. 
That is check marks of plenty. We gotta stop dying, Trick Room. Okay, so we gotta have a talk. Stop it. Stop it. Get out. Reset. I can't lose another player like this. Pummy's dropped low. What's Boat looking for here? Nah, Boat's gonna land this pulse bomb, chat. Watch this shit. Bo Boat's gonna land this pulse bomb. Right. He's gonna let out his inner J3. All that time, unfortunately. Gonna be going to the wayside. Pummy forced out. There's that teleporter cooldown. Yeah, they should have. King looking for that back line. Goes for it. Does not find it, however. Wait, both room. tracers let out the inner J3. Wait a minute. What can they look for? What can they find? Trick Room throw the mines out, take down tree, infected escapes and skates to the hacked out health pack. Now it's false in trouble, escapes to one that isn't quite as hacked, but still is dangerous as they've been backed into a corner. The rally's still available. Saints are coming up on support ultimates of their own. If the question is, can they buy time enough to get them online? They can. Boat down, the rally's still there. Trick Room only four players with an EMP. They're trying to reduce Holy Saints to zero. Can they finish up the health bars? No, Vega fighting it out. Zenyatta has come to play and he is kicking everybody out of his mega room. Bro, the strat that <laughs> Saints just, are I, doing I when they dive this. Vega, they Vegas nano him is literally Zenyatta just so insane. Able to, you nano know, boosted Zenyatta with an Ana Pocket and a Diva defense matrix in you is literally it scary. Has been consistently strong throughout this one and such a, I mean, so sick to watch. On top of that, it also gives Saints just so much flexibility, the fact that he can play this. So much so that not only is he able to at least pull his weight on this pick, but they also give him nano boosts constantly as well. It's been good. King both bombs just as much so. A trade for Mateball? Decently worth it. False actually dropped low. Hanbei forced a transcendence though, and they're gonna try and turn that into an engage, pressing forward into the cart. Pummy under pressure, 70% to an EMP as well. You need to be careful. You cannot be dying in moments like this. With yeah, that's gonna be bad though. 70% 70, 70 for an EMP, but they have three ults. Eight ball proceeds forward regardless of the time bank though, and pays the price for it. Infected as well. 55 seconds, one more fight, and a whole host of ultimates between them and the end of point B. Think this King is, really is fucking going off. Of, can Saints keep their backline alive? They have, I mean, the transcendence. They have the nano boost. We've seen what nano boost. Okay, chat. Could last fight. Do. They could throw that onto. They false have three ults. You guys think they win the last fight? Oh, Saints have four ults. But Saints are in such a good position to get a stop here. And if they do, Trick Room. Oh man, it does not look good for them. Dragon out to buy the high ground. EMP, it didn't hit the Zen. It didn't hit Vega. He was backed all the way up into the hallway. It gave him no chance. Now slept out. Infected in a lot of trouble. Eats the volley. They're going to nano the Zen again, yep. Hanzo. Oh and my Trick god, Ronaldo's the nano Zen headshot on the Tracer. Again, Herix. You outlined it. We've seen it before. It's a story meant to be told over and over. And trust me, with a game this good, it's something to tell your grandchildren about. Wait. Oh, there goes Pummy. Wait, what? I there play Overwatch. Hanbei. I'm not gonna have any kids. No what? Shot. No one fact, likes me. Be able to get past everybody. And just like that, Trick Room, their attack is thwarted. It's not it GG. It's not GG tracks. yet. It's not GG. Second objective. It's not GG. Not they can still them, hold this. They can still hold this. I mean, I guess technically, the worst showing that we've seen from their attack despite being one of the best starts for their attack and a lot of that came down to what you're seeing right here but i Pummy really want them i really want them to whip out the widow for defense this widowmaker especially and protect the shit out, out of him out with out zen brig so it's zen brig and in, widow man, on top of each other sitting maker, in the far back everything has been fantastic from Pummy, even the sojourn but alas not meant to be the b Push is where the line and the sand is drawn. Trick Room need to stop them or it is tournament life gone. A vice champion, you will be crowned and Saints will walk away with the larger part of that massive prize pool. Can Trick Room pull something out, man? I mean, how many times, how many times can they get away with what feels like absolute miracles? Now to be placed into a position where they're in map six and still have a shot to get a map and move things even further along. I mean, remember, again, we've been talking about it all day, but these players have been playing, I mean, quite literally all day themselves. But 
I like the way that we're starting things off. Pummy, we've already seen him popping off on this Widowmaker. Now going to be matched at least for the time oh, being. Oh, are we going to see the Widowmaker match to go up? Back, make that swap. I'm curious to see if does he go Hanzo or does he instead swap to something else? It looks like Hanzo is okay, going to be the I, choice. Okay, hey, hey, wait. They're listening to me. The Zen Brig with the Widow in the back line. Wait a minute. The I should be a coach. Of this map, especially in the hands of such a capable player. Now as Trick Room back away, I think it begins to dawn on them. They were scared of the pressure of a map number five earlier against Redbirds. We were talking to Mateball about what he was going through, how he just wanted to be out of that match so he could get on to the next one. Well, the next Wait. one's here. And I hate to tell you, it's even more stressful. Shots out from Pummy, cowering behind a crate here. The Hanzo nails him time after time, but he refuses to go down. Saints looking for a dive target, but Dude, Jay, you actually should? Away. No, I'm not coach material. If I was a coach and my team Saints was losing, they looked away. at me for coaching, I'd just be like, yeah, Slowly don't fucking suck, surely. just win. Getting that payload <laughs> just hit your forward. shots, I don't know what to and tell you, bro. It's gonna come down to these oh snipers. God. I have to imagine who's gonna land that shot and Dude. give their team the advantage. Everyone's looking at Pummy right now. It, it is not just Tree. It's Vega, it's CJ, it's King. Everybody wants this Widowmaker right now. But like, I mean, technically, if you don't lose, you win, right? Arrow, healed back up. Neutral, played, boat, backs away. Blinks over to collect the health pack. Why do we Pulse hear the Hanzo? Do I have another... It. Recall. Both available. You guys hear the... With the first pick. It's been silent for so long, but he gives Trick Room a chance and they've already ripped two minutes off this time bank without an elam that's insane yeah you see you see yeah, how much pressure crazy. the widow I mean, puts on the team without any picks no picks but two minutes gone everything and they've they're scared already, to yeah, pick like, the widow that means they're they're the they, they respect pummy's widow is looking to buy just a little bit more they have to be so careful here though as these ultimates come up things become far more dangerous time to kill goes drastically down and any no, mistake I'm instantly right. could sway a fight there oh, you go. Shot. One more. Pummy's got an opener. Tree peeks the corner. Tries for the arrow. Oh, that and they man. got the diva out of the mech. Don't kill the diva. The nice. Line. Leather, leather gets staggered. She's probably gonna jump off the map. Done a great job of playing bouncer. The pummy, making sure that he cannot be reached by that tracer, and it's opened up so many opportunities. Speaking of opportunities, not too many left here for Saints, especially if they can't find a way to get back and pressure Pummy. Now Pummy doesn't have those sights, but. Even still, I mean, King has to find a way to actually get back there and has clearly struggled in doing so. Pummy has answered him every single time. Just got to watch out for that Tracer. That Tracer is going to be annoying, but I think Trick saying, is going to put you know Boat on Let's Tree so Tree doesn't contest Pummy. Pummy sees this swap and look where he's going all the way back oh! in the way you're getting to me. Force the Transcendence too. That's huge. Which is like correct. If there's two DPS after you, that's effectively a two for one trade. You could be effectively dead. You could stay far away and he will, but he does want teeth in the fight. Pummy lines himself back up to try and take down Vega, but Saints managed to cower into the Mega Room safely. 45 seconds on the clock. Time has flown by for Saints. They have taken one fight proper, and now goes the second. Vega falls. Another advantage for Trick Room. And a map which, I mean, they practically owned two times in a row. Saints no way, and you guys were saying three. GG, and you guys were saying <laughs> fucking GG, Saints it's not over until it's over, chat. They had the winning formula, and oh man, it clearly feels like they don't. King is down, yeah, they have go, to get Jay. infected here, and they're not going to. If if Trick they're Room wins right this map, I will get 50 subs right now. On a silver platter, and he is cooking them right on up for him. Everything you invested in this player seems to be worthwhile right about now as he is producing. Oh, and he has mines! And he has glory. mines, and look where the card is! One more fight. Even up the it's a deep. Oh! Number seven. False drop low. Nano boost thrown onto the diva. Oh, that's Everybody massive. That's massive. The and they're gonna King. see nine. Take down Pummy, though. That two man dive to the back line is worth it at the end of the day for Saints. False drop low again, though. He's got a bomb to re mech with, but Trick Room are in the back line looking just. Wait, did I just jinx this? Before. This is where they can thrive. This is where they Wait. can shine in moments. Hanbei drop Wait, low. Trick Room, I'm so sorry. Can test a cart. Oh, but with both Wait. Doesn't seem likely. Oh, just Wait. Like that as well. Magic Mateball was just out there on an island alone, and somehow Saints, they squeak out a point A cap. That just didn't look like it was going to be possible for quite some time there. But they get the job done. Two minutes, or they're just over that here. Acquired by the Saints. As they start to get back up into position, they need to find a way to break down the high ground hold that is going to take place here by Trick Room. And if they can do this quickly, they might be able to make this <laughs> a, a one-fight setup. Yeah, 
They've got a huge advantage. I actually think it might be more Let's go Saints! To try and engage now and take two fights and at least get some of those ultimates out. But, I mean, it's Woo! such a tall order. Tree lurking the pulse bomb. King's got the EMP. The cart just far enough. Hanbei melted down before he can get a stop. Oh, no, 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 no. Wait, he didn't reset his translocator, did he? He's back at first point. Bo takes out Vega. Oh, that might be uh. a way in, at least potentially here. Vega looking to come back, looking to establish that ultimate as well. They need that potential for the brawl to be able to just stay on the. No, play. don't die infected. Oh, don't die infected. God. Don't die infected. He's in a world of hurt. Take no. Okay, they force transcendence. The connects transcendence out from Hanbei. Trick room need to win the fight and soon. Mines are almost up, but he's just not there. The contest on the card is only coming from boat. Come on, boat. Come on, boat. Defense. Come on, boat. You have, the, you have the transcend. Uh, no, oh my God, that recall scared the shit out of me. Wait a minute. Line. Two on two, but in comes infected. Drops the mine. Maybe just saves the day. He and Bo just have to stagger out. They've got the spawn advantage. Everything is there. A tracer dropped low. Tree found out. Recall forced. He wants to still... his health back. And he just reaches salvation on the other side. Saints have another shot. Trick Room have got to regroup and find a way in. CJ's got the Nano to make it happen. They still have another fight Tree chat. It's 30 seconds. They have Nano. And, and they almost have another EMP. The Trick Room has two ults, though. And they have no support ults. It. They only get one more chance. Look out for this EMP though from the King. EMP Nano is going to be massive. They're going to EMP and probably Nano up. the Sombra, or not the Sombra. They're going to probably Nano CJ, the Diva. Throwing out that Nano boost onto False, running down that backline and seeing if they can get some kind of advantage in this fight. Trick room looking for. No first. way! They got the Nano. Wait, they got the Nano off. They got the Nano off. The Nano boost comes out though. False doesn't know how to use it. He's walking around, unsure of himself. EMP out. Puppy lives on the high ground. Wait, he got the stick. He got the stick. He got the stick. Saints have the numbers, Saints have the win, and Saints are your no first place way, champions bro. of the <laughs> no qualifiers. Way. What a series! I what a series, right now, bro! What a series! Oh, that man, that last fight was like literally insane. Time, that, that last was minute. Go straight to a game seven. Who knows what would have happened there? Played beautifully, especially on defense. But dude. nonetheless, Saints oh just my god, dude! Again if they, they won that, it would have been a we game saw that seven, last bro. Second swap over to the tracer, over to the Sombra, looking for that backline, saying, "You know what? We're tired of this. We're tired of you sitting all the way back there, so bro. insulated, having that widow, having the Zen." Boat had boat had the directly, perfect stick. He will, he let the diva walk out, got oh, the stick on the Ana, but the Ana still got the shot. Nano on the fucking like, diva, bro. Man. That was insane. Oh Honestly, I really do hope over. Watch League is on the on uh, is on Twitch, bro. So we can do the more of these little watch parties, man. These watch parties are so fun. I didn't think it would be this fun.